out on the beach without freezing. Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times, we'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Hi guys, welcome back and Merry Christmas. It is officially Christmas Eve. We finished up work last night, so today we are pretty much exclusively devoting towards getting the place ready for Christmas Day. We are having my brother and my niece around for Christmas, which I am so excited about. I've only seen him once in the past year because obviously COVID, so I'm just over the moon that we get to see him for Christmas Day. So we are trying to do what we can with the helm. Obviously, we're still very much in the process of decorating so there are some kind of um, empty bits here and there but we want to try and clear away some more of the boxes and just tidy things up as best we can um, and then this evening we are having a nice little Christmas Eve dinner so really excited about that I thought I would vlog our Christmas Eve and our Christmas day um, so today will probably be a little bit dull it is just literally organization um, but then also sharing with you some of our Christmas day as well so I hope you guys enjoy this and and I am going to get cracking. Okay, so I thought I would show you the new bar stools that arrived before the kitchen and gets super messy. It's definitely not going to remain this tidy. We have all the Christmas food kind of hiding out in various places, but the bar stools arrived yesterday and they've been on order, I think for like 14, 15 weeks. So it's been a while. Really, really excited about them. So they're pretty plain and simple, um, just kind of a white linen, and then they have the silver stud detail. I'm really happy with the wood as well because I feel like it is quite a good match for the floor. Tested them out last night and I thought they were great. <laughs> so yeah, seriously, the rest of the place is a little bit messy, but we will be tidying that up. Um, but. Yeah, really, really happy with these. Uh, they aren't the comfiest in terms of squishiness, but they are like, they're quite supportive and they are comfortable after a long period of time, if that makes sense. So yeah, really happy with them. Last day of my advent calendar, which Dan got me, which I've been loving so much. So day 24, ooh, hand cream. Don't think I've ever had so many hand creams in one time. Wasn't it basically 24 hands? No, there was also um, there was lip balm and and hand cream, and then there was cuticle cream and hand wash. Basically, a lot of things to do with the hands. <laughs> so, if any of you, I'm guessing this is a UK only thing, but if you see this next year, I would recommend. I really enjoyed it, and it also like the actual advent calendar smells amazing. It just smells very, very delicious. It was nice to have a change every day from chocolate, that is. Yes, I am on my way.
Merry Christmas you guys. So it is finally Christmas day and we've had a bit of a busy morning to be honest. We've been dashing around trying to get everything sorted but I think we're finally there now, thank goodness. Um, so we are going to be pouring some drinks now and getting started with the festivities. For those of you wanting to know my outfit, um, just I kept it really simple, my Max Mara skirt, fluffy white sweater and then I just made it a little bit more festive with a red lip. Okay, so I am going to attempt to do the table now. We have some fabric here, and I did not do a trial run this year, so we're gonna see how it goes. Santa's coming to visit No, he wouldn't miss this In Christmas times oh, Okay, so the tablescape hasn't quite gone to plan because I can't find the napkins or several other bits. Um, this is why you need a trial run, I guess. And I don't think we have time to find them before the meal, so we're just gonna make do. Um, but it kind of came together through a group effort the candlesticks, we have the placemats, obviously we need the plates, but they're warming up. Smiley starting in the background. So yeah, kind of there. Oh my god. Well it wasn't up, so I've like given it a bit of air. <laughs> Dana overdid a bit with the fire. Santa's coming to visit No, he wouldn't miss this In Christmas times Oh, and the sun said it is just getting better On a blanket with the skyline painted in blue Ooh, yeah, that's what we do We'll be chilling and happy Okay, so we just did a couple, but it's my brother did. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh gosh, it's more as well. You genuinely should think about this. What did you get? It's fine. I got a Villa Poppy. Nice. Whiskey. Ooh. Chocolate. Ooh. And I'm not sure if it's a sloop or personalised, but even the joke was about spicy stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and it was, as my mum would put it, a cracker of a joke. What in does the jalapeno say in winter? I'm a little chilly. That's a classic one right there. What did you get? Oh, is that slime? Nice. So, I got a Bai Terry lip gloss. Oh my goodness. A bracelet. A perfume. And you can touch Charlotte Tilbury. Yeah, oh my goodness. Yeah. Here's a ridiculous Oh yeah. Had a little trimmings. Just you know for one portion bash. So that's a very happy accident. And that's what when when How much are you enjoying, enjoying the potatoes? potatoes? Great. I used that something else and <laughs> Santa's 
we're slowly tidying up, but lots of destruction everywhere. So I just came upstairs to escape the madness downstairs for a few minutes and I thought I'd show you a few other things I got. I will do a full kind of what I got for Christmas video, but I thought I'd show you a few bits and pieces now. So I'm really into my coloring. So Dan got me, in fact, a few people got me coloring books. So I got a whole bunch of them and this was one of them, which I thought was so cool. I do enjoy my motivational sayings. I thought this is really nice. I find it really relaxing um, and there are just so many cool, patterns to do here and he got me two of these and then my brother also got me a Disney one as well which I also enjoy so I am very excited to get stuck into this. Dan also got me some socks he does like to get me socks and these are so cute they come with their own little sock bags which I've never seen before so there's this little piglet there's a little cat and then there is a panda version of course he also got me this mug that says I can't adult day which accurately represents my 2020 and then my sister-in-law, Hannah, got me this amazing gift set full of Elemis products. I've never actually tried this line, I don't think. Um, so I'm super excited to give it a go. And there's everything here from the Pro Collagen line. There are some rose-scented products as well. She knows I love rose-scented items. Just so much good stuff. So I was blown away by this. It looks absolutely amazing. And then I also got Obama's book as well. I did not realize this was as hefty as it is. Like, oh my goodness, it's huge. So it's gonna take me a little while to work my way through it, but I am excited to get stuck into that. So I will do a full what I got for Christmas video, I promise, but I thought I'd share a few of these gifts now. Just so, so lovely, all of them. Like I'm a, sorry, what? The, if it's like a main character from 98, I'm done. <laughs> we're discussing the Disney game that we're about to play. And Pictopia? Yeah. Nice. Um, so we're about to do a dessert, had some yummy yeah, cake. We're also going to be doing chocolate fondue with this yummy platter and then testing our Disney knowledge. Room for more. That's why it's just moist. Could do it. <laughs> Dan undefeated by all the food. <laughs> Dan, what are your top three Christmas films of all time? American Thirty Four Street, Die Hard One, Die Hard Two. Oh, that's a rubbish list. Matthew. Um, mine are going to be really girly ones. Uh, I'll probably say Christmas Chronicles. Nice. Love Actually. Huh. And Elf. Yeah, I'd go Elf. The holiday. Yeah, I thought about the holiday, but it's not as good as love actually. <laughs> but wait, which Home Alone? Mm. We watched both in the last month, didn't we? Two. Yeah, two. One. Bit one. That's it. I like the second one. I think more. The Ooh, second one's quite cool, cool. Yeah. So Christmas is officially over. It is now Boxing Day today and I am still so poor from yesterday. Uh, but I thought I would leave the vlog here just because today is going to be much the same as yesterday, just a lot more eating and drinking. I hope that you guys enjoyed this little festive vlog. I hope that you had a great Christmas as well. I know this was a bit of a different one, um, but I hope you managed to celebrate in some little way if you do celebrate. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next one. Bye.